welcome back to Good Day Stateline. We're celebrating Betty White tonight, and there's one man who's been working on getting today named Betty White Day for some time. His name is Conrad. Hello. Hello. Good to be here with you. Yeah, we were so excited to talk to you because we knew all about you, you know, prior to, of course, Betty passing, and we knew you were trying to get today to be Betty White Day, but I don't know why this has been your life goal. So that's what I want to hear about, Conrad. <laughs> why is this your dream? <laughs> I was really uh, looking forward to a Betty White Day because I started this over a year ago um, before her birthday last year and I thought it would be a great way to honor her because she's just such a trailblazer. She has been an amazing comedian for decades and so I thought it would be just a great way for people to learn more about her and to honor her in her hometown. So when did your love for Betty White start? It started when I was a kid, when I saw her on the Mary Tyler Moore show as Sue Ann, or Sue Ann Nivens, and they were, it was just reruns. And then I really fell in love with her when I watched The Golden Girls. Mm -hmm. And I watched it all the way through, um, and I just completely fell in love with Rose. She was probably my favorite character on that show. And I realized what a great comedian she was because she's really able to take on a persona and make you believe uh, that she is that person. That is so true. It's hard to separate her from her characters a little bit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> So what I thought was very unique was your petition was to make today, January 17th, Betty White Day in Oak Park, which is here in Illinois. But you, you're you in Idaho, right? I was in Idaho, okay. yes. When I started this, I was in Idaho. Um, I was there for my master's program, but I've since moved back to my home state of Portland, Oregon. Okay, so um, even farther. <laughs> Exactly. So, no, I'm not a resident, unfortunately. So, um, I sent it off to the council and was hoping that they would make that change, but I was not a local. <laughs> well, of course, now we know that, you know, since Betty has passed today is actually Betty White Day in the entire state of Illinois. So, you, you got to believe you had something to do with that. Hopefully, <laughs> and if not, that's okay. Um, it was just a fun project that I was doing for her. And um, even though um, it didn't come to fruition in um, Oak Park, it's still a good thing that she's getting as much um, attention as she did. Unfortunately, it's because of her passing. Yeah. But what a great testament to her that people say like 99 years was too short. <laughs> like what, what an amazing um, thing to have happen for her. Absolutely. One of my favorite things that I heard, um, you know, on social media after she passed was how wonderful it is that Betty White actually knew so many people loved her while she was still alive, which isn't, you know, true for everyone doesn't get to hear of that. And we were all like loving on her for years. <laughs> yes, exactly. Even that petition to get her on SNL and yeah, everyone loved Betty White. I didn't see anything bad about her right. ever. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think we should all do tonight to celebrate Betty? Betty was a huge animal um, lover, mm -hmm. and I um, saw something that I didn't come up with, but to honor her, um, to share some um, pictures and postings from local animal shelters of, pe of animals for, you know, people who might be lonely during the pandemic or people who want a pet, um, because she was such a huge advocate for animals. So. I would love it if people shared some local organic or local humane society uh, posts so that people can start loving on those little critters. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The Betty White Challenge. We are actually uh, talking to someone from the American Humane Society next about that. So, so oh, you did perfect. a perfect little segue for us, Conrad. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for being part of our tribute tonight. We appreciate your time. Absolutely. Have a great day. We'll be right back with even more Betty and our girly Let's Try It. <laughs>